Hey guys, it's Zeke here, and today I'm uh, going to do a WoW Let's Play for you guys. I haven't played, I played this game, I just recently got into it, at the end of uh, Mop, Miss Pandaria. And um, I think that, uh, I, it's a really fun game, I like to play it. But uh, we're going to jump right into it, and uh, it's just going to be a WoW Let's Play on a new character. So what I think I'm going to do, is I'm probably going to do, um, I'm, I don't know. I was kind of thinking about this before. I was thinking of being an either an undead on the horde side or a human on this side. Because I've never, never, ever made a human or a dwarf or anything. I play horde mostly. So, actually, yeah. Let's do that. Oh, in the server I'm on, guys, is uh, Dalvinger. If you guys want to come play with me, that would be great. Um, but this, sir, uh, this character, let's think about it. Hmm. Well, I played Draenei few times but and I don't know he's all beefy and I have huge I don't know that might be him he's pretty cool play a night elf don't want to play them you saw on the main screen my 90 even though you can get up to 100 but <laughs> but um I'm playing a gnome now so it's gonna either be a human a dwarf or a warrior or a panda I don't know panda so fat so fat <laughs> Don't underestimate the panda. Um, but anyways, the organ chew your freaking head off. But uh, I don't know. I think I'm. Mm, you know what? Let's do a human, cause I have never done a human in my life, ever. Actually, I think I played a human priest like to level 20 or something. But uh, I don't know. Um, okay. So human. Ah, uh, I don't. I don't know. Um. Mage, Warlock, Monk? I, no, I don't want to play Monk. Uh, rogue, maybe? Maybe Rogue? Or Paladin? Or Warrior? Or Hunter? I don't know. <laughs> Can't be a Shaman or a Horde Druid, but that makes sense. Um, maybe we should do Paladin. What do you guys think? I don't know. Or Rogue. Rogues are, rogues are cool. Never been a rogue. Not really. Not that much. It's between paladin and rogue. I played a paladin. I haven't played a rogue that much. It's gonna be it's gonna be human rogue? Yep, it's gonna be rogue guys. That's what it's gonna be. Human rogue. Uh alright, skin color. Um uh, I'm gonna try and make him I don't know, I'm, I might make him look like me, maybe. Except for he's like probably freaking forty years older than me. <laughs> Uh, but, uh, um, all my skin color, let's, let's just, let's just see that one, that doesn't really matter, face, um, <laughs> this guy's sad, <laughs> he's like, oh, look at his mouth right there, <laughs> this guy's like, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, anyway, let's get past that, um, maybe that one, because rogues, like, sneaky, he can be bald, because bald bald guys look buff. I don't know. It's gonna be bald, even though I'm not bald. My hair is kind of like that. Not really. Um, but down here, ponytails. No, I'm not gonna have ponytail. Not gonna... They're trying to make me look like a woman. What are they trying to do? Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. We're just gonna go with bald, because bald people are look buff. So <laughs> they look cool. I don't know. Um, his hair. You know what? It's gonna be like a reddish ginger because that that is why I, I I don't know. It's actually gonna be black. Yeah, it's just gonna be black. And facial hair. Um, I don't know. Should he have that? Or should he just have? I don't know. This. That's what he had before, right? I'm just gonna stick with that. And. Uh, name name always comes um i don't know i do not a donut no i don't <laughs> i do not know to name this guy he will be well he's a rogue so uh dagger dagger to the face i don't know uh slicey man <laughs> slicey man uh, I don't know. Um, 
how about... I don't know! It could be like, uh, you know what? Um, it's gonna be... Uh, Mr. Mr. Dot... Stabby. Dang it, King. Contain, okay. Mr. Stabby. That's not available. Okay, too wise. Not available either. Too easy. Not available. Nope. Um. Mr. Stabby. Here, how about this? Stabby. Jabby. Stabby Jabby. Stabby Jabby it is. Here, let me fix my mic real quick. There you go. It's like on my face. Stabby Jabby. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. All right, here we go, guys, on the adventure of Stabby Jabby. You know what? I didn't start a timer. How did I? I don't know how long that was. Be silent for this. The proud humans of Stormwind led the alliance to victory in its war against the dreaded Lich King. While successful, the campaign in Northrend proved costly, and the humans now seek to bolster their strategic holdings throughout the world. Under Varian's daring leadership, humanity now braces itself for a renewed conflict with its perennial enemy, the Horde. Yet, as the great cataclysm rips across the world, familiar threats have once again arisen closer to home. It now falls to you to defend the kingdom and uphold the honor of humanity. Uphold the honor of humanity. I don't know if you guys could hear that, but... Uh, just in case you guys could, um, I was silent during it. <laughs> but here we go, guys, on the adventure of uh, Stabby Jabby. He's bald. <laughs> well, we got the first quest. It was to uh, kill Blackrock Wargs. So let's go do that. I don't know if you guys want me to read the quest or not. You guys can comment down below if you want me to do that. I might just start doing it just because. But uh, just to just to do it. But I don't know. But I'm gonna. So we gotta kill Block Rock Orcs, Orcs, Wargs, not Orcs. <laughs> to uh, so that um, so because I think the like the Horde are invading the Orcs. I think yeah, these guys right there. So they're, like spying on us with their Orcs and their, their stuff. So I think each video will be like about maybe 15 minutes long. <laughs> Wait, look at this. Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> Looks so weird when they jump. The new character models look pretty weird. Look at how he's running. Here's a quest. You bought us a little time, Stabby Jabby, but we've <laughs> Stabby Jabby, but we've got even bigger problems to deal with now. And I got uh, a belt. Cool. Okay. The invading orcs aren't fools. They're sizing us up, making sure that when they attack, it will be to their advantage. In the forest to the northwest are Black Rock spies. They peer at us through spy glasses, watching our every move, waiting. I want you to take the fight to them. Kill the Black Rock spies. We must show them that we know they are watching us and that we are prepared. So we gotta go kill some uh, some Black Rock orc spies. Let's go do that. Like I said, there they are. All the spies. Let's go kill him. Cause, ooh, kill him. Wait. Thinks he's sneaky? Mr. Sneaky? No, I'm sneaky. Well, actually, I'm stabby, not sneaky. Let's do this. Watch out. That's right, get wrecked. Bro, rogues are OP. Penis. That's right. If you guys have any comments or not comments well advice i should say or something that you guys want me to do um comment down below and i will probably try and make sure that i do it so that we can uh so that you guys will be uh content with the videos to uh, like tell me if uh my uh the audio is too high in the game or my voice is too low or anything like that oh we completed the quest okay let's loot all these guys 
Actually, I think I'm gonna turn on a few things because I like I like mailbox and the hearth and the profession trainers and the repairs to be on because I don't know I just like that. Actually, yeah, there is a reason because I don't want to know where all that stuff is. So um, also I want to know um, uh, I want to know if you guys uh, like when you guys want to play with me. Just uh, you know comment down below and I'll be like okay boo we'll get on. Yeah. Um, okay. I want that on controls. I want auto loot on. All right, let's go. Okay. Here we go. We're almost level three. Yeah, level three. Cool. Leveled up. Okay. The next. Oof, uh, I already know about combo points. I was asked to bring this to your attention as soon as you returned from dealing with the Black Rock spies, Dabby Jabby. It appears to be a letter sealed with the insignia of Jorik, one of our local trainers. I wouldn't hesitate to read it before you go about any other business here in the Abbey. Uh, read the encrypted letter and speak with whoever. Okay, so letter. Um, read it. I read it. And... I didn't really read it, but... <laughs> what, okay, what does it say? I think the quest is back here. Never been more proud to be part of the trade as I am these last few years in need for assassins, spies, and scouts has never been more prevalent. You'd think wartime would have would have had higher demand, but surprisingly, war isn't a time we we flourish like we do now. Times after peace starts to deteriorate. I was told you'd be in the area looking uh, looking to learn a few things. When you have time, come see me by the stables in the back of the abbey. The rope trainer. So I believe this starts to your just kind of teaches you how to play play your class. I do. All right, this one. By now you you know the basics of combat as a rogue, but I want to teach you your you a new skill as a rogue. We are renowned for our ability to execute chains to combat techniques, often saving the most powerful strikes for the end. Uh, okay. Because it texts me again, sorry. As you get more experience, you'll learn the new things, and this is one of the ones you'll learn first. Once you have, I want you to go to try it out on one of the training dummies. South of the entrance to the Abbey. Read level 3 and learn S3. Okay, find training dummies. Use that. Well, we're already level 3, so we can go ahead and do that. And uh, then we'll prob probably, I'll probably call it a uh, video that we'll see you guys next video. But uh, for now, Bush, stupid freaking bush, get out of the way. Mm. Oh, it's the graveyard here. Okay. I'm just respecting those people that died in the war. What's the cool training area? Can I jump on the ropes? Okay. So I use this and I use that and uh, I have no more energy. This sucks. Okay. And, eh. Ah. Alright. And uh, in the max level, guys. Tell me if you guys want to see PvP or PvE or whatever. Just tell me what you guys would like to see when I get up there in max level and stuff on this let's play. I might continue it from there, but I might end it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. And there might be some uh, surprise guests. Maybe. Just maybe. There might be. I don't know. Maybe. But we might invite like uh, Sean or something to come in. Com 29. And uh, might invite maybe some other people <laughs> like other people I play with and uh, yeah so we complete this quest guys and uh, let's read this one I think we had time to do one more while you're out training I received an urgent message from sergeant William turns out the black rock orcs have hired goblin assassins they ambushed our battalion behind the abbey William has asked me to send him a hero you have to go help them stabby jabby <laughs> Can't get over that name. Find Sergeant William north of the Abbey at the command tent. Go! Go! Fine, I'll go. <laughs> so, he's over here, I believe. I think so. I guess he's over here, yeah. Should be over here. But, yep, there he is. Look at him. All gold. Looking at a telescope. I'm pretty sure he's looking through that 24 7. All the game. The whole game has been looking through this. Okay. Have you ever seen the goblins, Dabby Jabby? They're wretched little green skinned monsters that love only two things, gold and themselves. The Black Rock Orcs have enlisted the aid of the goblin assassins to kill our soldiers. If you look to the field in the north, you can barely make out their cell hoots sneaking about in the grass. 
I need you to head out there and kill every goblin that you see. They need to learn that nobody messes with the lions. Just kill eight of the goblin assassins and I get a cool belt. A shiny new belt. And um, this one. Have you embraced the holy light yet, brother? It is through the holy light that we were saved. Or we are saved. It is through the holy light that I am able to heal the, these overlaid demanding soldiers. And it is through the holy light that you will be... Okay, we get it about the holy light. Be able to venture... Uh, out into the field to the north and rescue our fallen brothers. Take this prayer book with you into the field to cast the light's healing touch on the injured. So he have four injured, and we get the rest. Alrighty. Alrighty, guys. Looks like, uh, yeah. Looks like we're coming to the, this is the end of the video here. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, all that good stuff. If you like the video and stuff, make sure to comment uh, for all tips and things if you want to play with me and stuff with stabby jubby and uh subscribe because that would really help me out a lot and uh see you guys next uh, next video later